Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well and uh, I want to show you today the view from the Monkey Bridge. You can see uh, uh, here is this kind of boat, so they will carry uh, the sand uh, down the river and this is used uh, for sometimes the coal, but most of the time it will be the sand that they use for the construction. And uh, if you go, st you look straight, there is the statue of Mao Zedong and the Orange Island over there. And this on the left, the left side is Yelushan. And over there, uh, this is Shinkaipu district and there is the park from Shinkaipu district. As you can see, there are many cars today. Uh, it's about six o'clock. Many people, they go back home at this time. And on the left over there, you have the new district where I like to, uh, to go running. And uh, I'm not sure if, uh, I think, uh, in less than one year there will be many people living there but I don't think they will manage to sell all these buildings there will be many empty buildings so here they are they will have a five-star hotel over there on the left and also a big shopping center a big shopping mall and a school so this of course will will be something so that uh, people my, I think people will come to this place because they know there is the hotel, they know there is the shopping mall, there is the school. And also you should know that Changsha city is divided in two. In the middle of Changsha city there is this Xiangjiang river. And uh, the right side, on the right side, you, you, you have all the cities, so the buildings. So this is on the side over there. You have all the, the city. And on the left side here, this used to be the university district. So you uh, had very few people who lived there and the real estate price were much cheaper and over there the real estate price were much higher. Now it's changing a lot because they built many bridges and many underground uh, tunnel and also you have the subway so more and more people go to live on this side. But on this side hopefully uh, the Yelushan, the mountain and uh, these areas they are protected and also you have a few universities. It means they cannot build over, the, over there. And since they cannot build, it's, it will stay uh, green. So I think it's a good place to live and a good place where to invest. Because you, you're sure that uh, there will still be some trees, there will still be some uh, the mountain, they will not build over there. While on the other side of the city, everything will be built in the, in the future. If this continues like this, everything will be built. And as you can see, the river is really uh, going uh, up a lot because it has been raining and raining and raining in South China and in Central China. It has been raining so much. And there are probably students from the university. Uh, in the evening, on the riverside, you have uh, many uh, people who like to go there. Uh, to uh, ride bikes, uh, drink the tea, and just even sing, uh, sing outside. You have some KTV outside, and it's really nice. Or drink some beer. So during summer, it's really nice to go there and just enjoy your time in the evening. It's not so hot, also. You see, just here, you have so many people usually in the evening. And uh, I will leave you for now. I just wanted to show you the, all this. Take care and see you soon.